What's up guys? Welcome to ClickFeed Media, the ultimate source for top 10 lists on the internet. My name's Gary. And I'm Caitlin. And this week we're listing our top 10 ways to please a man that you might not know. Give him a sensual massage. That's right ladies, men also like a gentle touch. Studies have shown that sex is at least 30% more enjoyable when all the muscles in the body are completely relaxed. All you need is a good pair of hands and some oil. And for the more adventurous among you, you may not even need the hands. Food play. If you think about it, it's perfect. What's a man's two favourite activities? Sex and eating. So why not combine the two? Studies have shown that the smell of food alone increases arousal levels by 25%. Anything from whipped cream to chocolate to Skittles, it all goes. I'd like to taste that rainbow. <laughs> Hit him in the crotch with a cactus. Studies have shown that... I'm sorry, what? That ought to make things less prickly between the two of you. Wait, hang on, did you say cactus? Outdoor sex? Venturing into the great outdoors will not only make the experience more erotic for both of you, you'll also be able to work on a great tan as well. Just make sure your fences are high enough. It'll be a breath of fresh air for the both of you. Seriously, cactus? Make him wear a blindfold. But Gary, then he won't be able to see. Well, that's the point, Caitlin. Out of the five senses, sight is the one most predominantly used by humans. Once it's taken away, all the other senses heighten to compensate. That, combined with the taboo nature of this act, make it ideal for anyone looking to improve their sex life. And if you're looking for something a little more extreme, let's see what's at number five. Wait, what did you mean by extreme? Rub Tabasco sauce into his eyes. Has sex changed since I last had it? We did say things were going to get spicy. This is hardly what I meant. Did you know that the eyes are the most sensitive part of the human body and that the introduction of the hot sauce doubles that sensitivity? Yeah, I'll bet it does. This is a surefire way to spice up your relationship. Sacrifice a cat to the pagan god of fertility. Jesus. Not quite. <laughs> Killing animals? Isn't that illegal? And, and evil? What if you can't even find a cat? A dog will do. Or any animal, really. Studies have shown that not only are the gods real, their wrath is terrible to behold and must be tempered with blood sacrifice, the reward for which shall be a bountiful harvest. Jesus. Still no. Drip hot wax on his back. See, can we just stick to this kind of thing? Studies have shown yeah, that... Yeah, studies have shown that blah, blah, blah. More importantly, no laws or animals are violated in the process. Wax on, wax off, right? All right. Drip hot acid on his back. God damn it, come on. His parents are tied up in the corner. What? And if that's not enough, take out your trusty loaded semi-automatic pistol and shoot him right between the eyes. What the fuck? Then finish off his parents too. I think I might need to change my pants. And on that note, let's go to number one. Put his penis into your vagina. Wait, that's it? Seriously? No acid, no blood sacrifice, no murder. Just... And his penis is still attached to his body? 
Just regular old missionary position. Oh. Well, I guess that's for the sole purpose of procreation! <laughs> Michael, have you seen the What are you doing with the microwave? I'm building a time machine. And you had to use the microwave. I had a really great time tonight. Yeah, me too. So I was thinking, maybe we could take this upstairs. I was thinking the same thing. Well, I guess I'll slip into something more comfortable then. Now I'll go grab the cactus. And then, wait, what? 